Hey, what's up? Today I will find out how much range you will lose if you remove the arrow wheel covers. Beyond Nylon has done a similar test, but he did it with a long range Tesla Model 3. I will do it with a standard range plus. I just did a warm up run, so my consumption for the warm up run is 176. I drove 9.4 kilometers. I'm charging a bit because um, I think I will consume for the whole test about 60% of the battery. So let me show you which route I will take for the test. Right now I am somewhere in the south of Munich then I will take this A8 and then we will go up to this point and then we turn around and come back so first I will do it with the arrow wheel covers then I will come back and remove them so let me check how far is it now enter the roundabout and take the third exit so this is about 25 kilometers and the both way would be 50 kilometers so yeah, that's the plan. The weather today is quite nice. It's 17 and it's quite sunny outside and it's Sunday. So I picked a Sunday because there will be no trucks on the highway. Uh, Bjorn Island, when he did the test, he was driving mostly about 120 and I will try to maintain a speed of 130. So there is no speed limit on A8, but I won't go bonkers and uh, drive 180 or something. I will just do a more realistic uh, speed, 130 kilometers per hour. Oh, by the way, I have winter tires. I have these Pirelli winter tires that I got from Tesla. It's 23, 51, 45 R18, so it's basically 18 inch winter tires. And uh, when I remove the wheel covers, I will put the lug nuts uh, that I bought from Topfit, uh, the lug nut covers that I bought from Topfit. So I bought it from Topfit because uh, if you get them from Tesla, they cost 50 euro, but from Topfit you can get them for just uh, 20 euro, so it's cheaper. Other than that, recently I put hydraulic ceramic coat, so you just do it by yourself. You clean the car quite intensively and then you just spray it and buff it off. So the car looks quite nice and shiny, as you can see. We are ready to go for the first round of test and this one is with the air wheel covers. Off we go! Okay, we have driven 19 kilometers so far in 12 minutes. I have been able to maintain 135 kilometers per hour because there are very few trucks and uh, not so much traffic. So that's good. Um, and uh, I am at 71% right now. So I am expecting to turn around in about three minutes yeah so as you can see it's very nice sunny weather today so so the cold temperature is also not taking up too much extra consumption yeah that's uh, that's the update so I will turn around in a bit I just turned around uh, the traffic is a bit worse right now because they're all going to the Munich direction. My consumption so far is 10, 213 and I have yet to drive 20 kilometers. I'm cruising at 135 still even though there is a lot of traffic. Let's see how long I can maintain this. Yes, so that is the update. 
Okay, so I almost arrived. I encountered some slow traffic. The consumption went down a bit. Also, we are. I am now going downhill, so that also impacted the consumption. Uh, the average speed is probably around uh, 100, and we are at 63 percent. I've just arrived at the same charging location. The consumption is 178 watt hours per kilometer. The average speed is around 100 kilometers. The reason uh, is that I have to go to the highway and there are some traffic lights. So yeah, that's uh, more or less the reason. But in general, I try to maintain 130 to 135. So now I will change the wheel covers i will put the lug nut covers and the tesla logo covers and then uh, we go for another round i remove the wheel covers and install the top fit lug nut covers this is how they look like not too bad So let me show you. Yeah, they fit in quite nicely, and I think it gives a much better look to the car. The arrow wheels are nice for efficiency, but they look a bit ugly, to be honest with you. Um, so my plan is to use the arrow wheels uh, only when I'm doing really long distance trips, like 1,000 kilometers or more. Otherwise, I will just keep the car like this. I also put some uh, ceramic coating on the tire on the rims so they also look a bit shiny <laughs> that's nice yeah so that's about it I am charged up to 80% again there is no particular reason for charging the car actually I'm just charging because I don't have a home charger and tomorrow I will have to use the car the plan now is to do another round um, and measure the consumptions. So I reset my trip meter and off we go. Something I forgot to do is to change the wheel configuration. So I will just do it. So now it's set to 18 inch arrow. I have to set to just arrow cap kit. And then we are good to go. I have driven 17 kilometers without the wheel covers. The consumption right now is 26. I am again trying to maintain 135. I'm at 67%. Um, now keep left to take the eight. Yeah, so I drove about uh, 12 minutes for this round. Uh, I don't really remember what the consumption what the consumption was at this point uh, but it is probably a bit high. Uh, yes so I will just continue from here we still have to drive four minutes and then we turn around again. Okay so we drove 33 kilometers and we encountered again some slow traffic i'm cruising around 125 right now so 10 minutes to go 15 kilometers to go consumption again is 228 we are at 60 percent the speed limit is 120 now because of the traffic so i think the consumption is a bit higher as i can see here i think uh, with the wheel covers it was something around 200 if i remember correctly at this uh, stage yeah so i will continue driving and uh, wrap it up when i arrive 
I have just arrived at the same charging location. The consumption this time was 195. Uh, the average speed was a bit slower, but not really significant. It was due to the traffic. With the aero cover, the consumption was 178. So uh, this means that uh, we lose some uh, some significant amount of range, basically. Um, with the aero tires, I calculated the range would be 266 kilometers at these speeds. Let's say if you try to maintain 135 kilometers per hour on German autobahns. And without the arrow wheels, this range will drop down to 243 kilometers. So that is the final conclusion. So I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, see you in the next one.